welcome to another video all right so let's solve for x here okay solution so we have x equals to one on x so from here because it is complicated to work under the root sign here we have to remove the square root here to our square root size so this side will be x squared and we have 1 over x okay so from here we can make this side over 1 and do cross multiplication okay that will be x cube equals to 1 all right now before we can solve this we have to understand the sum and difference of cubes okay so s cube minus y cube is the same as x minus y x squared plus xy plus y squared and when we're given s cube plus y cube the same as x plus y okay x squared minus xy plus y squared okay so from here you can write this one as s cube minus one equal to zero so our x is x and my one is y remember we can write one one cube as one so we have s cube minus one cube equals to zero so this side becomes x minus one okay x squared plus one times x plus one squared equal to zero so with a zero product this one equal to zero x minus one equal to zero or x squared plus x plus one equal to zero so x equals one is the first solution to this problem okay so let's look at the other solutions x squared plus x plus one equal to zero so let's compare this one with the general quadratic equation okay so ax squared plus bx plus c so a is one b is one c is one so one 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 okay so we have x equals minus b plus or minus b squared minus 4ac on 2a don't forget a is 1 b is 1 c is also 1 okay so let's do the substitution from here x is same as minus 1 plus or minus so we have 1 squared 4 times 1 times 1 2 times 1 minus 1 plus or minus 1 squared 1 minus 4 2 okay so x is the same as minus 1 plus or minus square root of minus 3 on 2 okay now from complex numbers okay square root of minus 1 is the same as i okay now from here you can write this as negative 1 plus or minus negative 1 times 3 so x minus 1 so this side will be square root of 3 times square root of minus 1 
plus 2. So from here, x is same as minus 1 plus or minus 3i on 2. Okay, so it means the second solution will be minus 1 plus 3i on 2. And the third solution will be minus 1 minus 3i on 2. That's that. Simple as that. Alright, so that's that.